Despite the grave restrictions of the morning dress, it is your gift, my dear. It's what you've brought to us. A sense of fashion, better hair as well. As the costume designer, uh, you meet with the director and you read the script, of course. We sort of go through some ideas of how to approach the piece. It is a modern Shakespeare, so it is in that realm, even though it's modern day. We talked a little about the iconic characters that are being represented. Kate's sort of like the young hipster sort of version of royalty, if you, as opposed to Camilla is much more from a traditional base, but she still has a very fresh look. It took searching through a lot of second-hand clothing stores to find the right double-breasted suit for Charles. They don't make double-breasted suits, it's, or it's very, you know, they're very, very expensive. Everyone else is in modern day clothes, so it was just a matter of finding the right style, the right cut, uh, and putting it together. We limited the color palette for the whole beginning of the show until Charles makes a big statement with a red military jacket. It was fun actually putting the actors' faces into the sketches. You don't usually do that. I was looking at images of them as well as images of the royals and the different people they were representing so that I could really mesh the two together and not make it an unusual look for that actor even though they're playing an icon like Charles.